how did it feel to be in the bad seat? Well, it felt, um, you know, I was a huge fan and admirer of the music and, and, and definitely of the work, you know, yep. that was going on, you know, with Nick. I was I was dumbfounded that they asked me to play, you know. And it was also that um, I was just asked to fill in for one tour, so I didn't expect more than a few weeks of shows, you know, to, to be involved. But as it turned out, I ended up, you know, uh, uh, moving to Berlin because I was ready to make a move. And uh, and like everything else, I just staked my claim. I'm like, I'm staying here. <laughs> I'm staying in the bad seats. And, uh, and uh, so, but, but the feeling like, I, uh, yeah, I felt it was the first time I was in a band where I felt, I felt uh, myself personally out of my depth, you know, um, and, and that will take many different, back on the psychiatrist's couch, many different uh, 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 forms, you know, uh, sexuality, one of being one of them. I mean, I know that they're very open-minded, liberal people, hedonistic, you know, that you know, homosexuality is not a big deal. You know, they had gay friends, they had lots of queer friends, you know, it was not, not, a, not a big deal, but this is something with their own where I fit in here, this is where I put the pressure only on, you know, on myself, you know, that I was like, oh, I really don't fit here, you know, uh, with this. And uh, and that started a sort of self-suppression uh, and and uh, self, uh, uh, self-negation, really, right. of sexuality, which is a strange thing to do in Berlin. And, um, but that's, that's far too psychological to, uh, <laughs> to, to go on about here. Um, <laughs> and it all ended, so it's fine. Who's that a young doll in flames? For up jumped the devil and he staked his claim on me. 